Friday, the National Weather Service issued a winter storm warning for our area. In response, Mountaintop spoke with Emergency Management Director Nee Jackson about what we can expect from this winter storm. Uh, the next 24 hours, we're going to see a um, what I would consider a major uh, swing in the weather. Um, we're going to go from a high today, 67, 68 degrees, to this time tomorrow, we're looking at low 30s. Um, Around 2 to 3 a.m. in Pike County, we're going to see a change um, from a little rain into snow. Uh, the snow is going to be very heavy. Uh, initially, because of the, the weather, um, we have so much ground warming that it's going gonna, it's gonna to have to snow a lot before it ever starts sticking. Uh, and they're saying that the accumulations are going to be anywhere from four to four and a half inches uh, and of course in higher elevations uh, could see up to six inches in Pike County. But the thing about it is, is it's going to snow a lot more than that because it's going to snow for quite some time before it ever starts sticking. So to, to be able to get six inches of snow, it could be snowing what would, would have possibly been 10 inches or something like that. But it, it's only going to accumulate to four to six inches according to elevation. Um, because of the, the ground being so warm, it's going to take a lot more, longer for it to start actually sticking on the ground. At Pikeville Medical Center, we believe that together we can make a difference in the fight against cancer. We are proud to have patients who have experienced successful outcomes over many years. As always, we believe in the power of faith. Pikeville Medical Center, where cancer can be defeated. Jackson continues to say that with warmer temperatures, snow will take time to accumulate and that road crews will be able to pre-treat roads. It, it, like I say, it's a drastic swing from 60 plus degrees into the 30s and all the way down into the teens and then back up into the 40s on Sunday and into the 60s on Monday. So you're going to see... Um, you're going to see accumulating snow, but it's going to be more of a heavy wet snow as well. So uh, need to pay attention to trees, power lines. Uh, hopefully we don't get any um, we don't get any outages, tree falls, or anything like that on lines uh, that would create any uh, inclement problems for uh, the residents. Lastly, Jackson says to monitor conditions and to wait to travel. For more weather updates, you can visit Mountaintop News or Weather.gov for the latest information. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Cordial.